if you look around now, there's so much bullying. It's such a big issue now. And knowing that I've been through that, I know what it feels like. Um, I know the repercussions that come with that. And I felt like something needed to be done. I wanted to use my story to, to help make a difference in the lives of others. The program I started is called Penn State Athletes Take Action. It's a program with myself and 13 other athletes who go on to the community and talk to kids about bullying just talking to them, using our status as athletes and showing them you know, what it means to be a leader, what it means to be responsible. I want the kids to see how painful it is when you bully someone. And I want people who bully to understand what they do to other people with their words or putting their hands on them or whatever it is that they're doing to bully them. I came here to play basketball and get a great education. Um, and being a Lady Lion is a great opportunity. That is a leadership role, but also it's not just about that. It's not just about basketball. I feel like you can be a leader outside of that. My coach, Coquies Washington, she's a great example as far as reaching out to the community and making a big difference. And she constantly talks to us about, you know, it's more than just about yourself. You know, you're here to make a difference. You're here to make an impact on the world. If you're here at a great university, you have the opportunity. There's so many people that have helped me to make this happen. I just want the athletes that believed in me to know that they're appreciated. I know I tell them, but I just feel like it's never enough. I really appreciate them. I think they've, they're a big deal to me. At first, when I thought of the idea, I knew that it was gonna be, it was gonna be hard just because of the training that was gonna be necessary to go and talk to these kids. And I think for some people, it's, it's, it's hard, it's hard work. And they're like, oh, well, you know, somebody else will do it. And if you really wanna make a difference, you can't just go with the flow, you can't go with the crowd. Um, it, it's easy to do that. And I didn't wanna be that person. I wanted to, I couldn't live with that. I couldn't know the feelings of being bullied and just settle for that and be okay with, with knowing that there's other people out there dealing with that and and not help. I couldn't live with the fact that I've been through that and not, and not doing something about it. I feel like I'm doing the right thing and using my story. I hope to make it bigger next year and to, to go to a lot of different schools. I do know that it's not gonna reach every single person, but obviously that's ideal and I would want it to, but as long as you know, it reaches someone and that I get satisfaction out of that potential. And then getting emails from teachers and saying, you know, this is making a difference. I'm just happy that they feel like it's making a difference and, and helping these kids. Just starting this has, has really given me the confidence to, if I do run into something that I potentially want to, um, where I can be a leader again, I, I have this and I believe that anything that I come across that gives me that opportunity again, I think I'll go for it. <laughs>